Hey, what's going on guys? It is Seth here with the Cruising Classics YouTube channel, showcasing this beautiful 1984 Buick Riviera we just added to our showroom. If you guys are in the market for a Buick Riviera, this is an excellent example. Only showing 81,000 actual miles. You guys can see it's outfitted in white with a white land out top and a blue vinyl and cloth interior. If you guys are interested in this car, have general questions about it, maybe questions about shipping, financing, whatever the case may be, feel free to give our friendly staff a phone call at 614-276-7355. This car does have power windows, power locks, and power seat. Beautiful blue interior. Looks like it's never been sat in front and rear. It does have a double den head unit in this car but we do have the original one in the trunk in case you want to put that one back in but it has a nice modern touch hook your phone up to it still listen to all your am fm stations and things like that you guys may have noticed it also has the electronic touch climate control as well and it does have the digital cluster up here besides the odometer which shows 81,206 miles. Let's go ahead and step back to our trunk. See the top here is in great shape. No rust or corrosion or peeling, anything like that with the top. Your bumper filler panels, front and rear are in great shape. There is a small ding just above my finger there, if you guys can see that. <coughs> Apologize for any background noise. We do have the build sheet here. The original window sticker for the vehicle. Copy of the original title there as well. Put those nice and neat back over there. And again, here's the original uh, radio. I believe, if I remember correctly, the reason why they replaced it was because the cassette didn't play, and again, they just wanted a modern stereo inside of this car. So if you want to put the original one back in, again, you can definitely do that. See the parts identification code there, the spid sheet. Same story over here, guys. Interiors in great condition. Power windows, power locks, and seat moves forward and backwards. Let's go ahead and step back around to the driver's side. We'll fire this thing up, then we'll take it on a drive. Reach down and pop the hood. Grab the keys. You'll see our antenna will come up momentarily. See the radio power is on. Not sure how well you guys can see it. Should be able to see it there. The antenna is coming up. Here the radio does work. We don't want to get copywritten though. Let's see, we'll turn this on the economy. Here, it doing its thing. Put that on low. You guys can see all the functions do work. Looks like right here they did add the USB port for the radio, which has CarPlay and Android Play, so makes it nice. You can plug it in right there. 
Let's go ahead and step out, check out what's under the hood. Alrighty guys, here's an underhood shot of the 84 Buick Riviera. Hopefully my shadow's not in the way, but you guys can see it's a nice tidy engine bay. It's very well kept and clean. No knocks, no ticks, no weird noises. If you guys have any questions about this car, again, our phone number is 614-276-7355. We're going to go ahead and jump in this thing. We'll take it on a drive and see how she does. Alright guys, welcome to the driving portion of the 84 Buick Riviera. Just going to be taking this car on a short drive, show you guys that it is a running and driving vehicle. And most importantly, it doesn't overheat, no miss shifts, nothing weird like that. You guys just watched the walk around video. You guys can see the car's in excellent shape and is ready for a new owner. Again, the odometer reads 81,202 miles. Obviously, we'll go up just a little bit as we're driving down the road and back to the showroom. But again, if you guys have any questions about this car, maybe shipping on how to get it to your front door or even financing, uh, give us a call. Our phone number is 614-276-7355. Go to roll up that window. Avoid these massive potholes we have here in Ohio. We're only about 13 minutes from the Columbus Airport, so if you want to fly in and drive this car home, you can definitely do so. Or if you just want to fly in and check the car out, hire an inspector. Both of those things happen all the time, and we're welcome to show you around the place and show you the car, obviously. But you guys can see this car does have the digital speedometer. Uh, I'm not sure if the camera is reacting to it or not, but sometimes with these older digital speedometers, the camera will make the speedometer flicker. So just want to let you guys know that is not happening in person. That is just a camera and car frequency thing. The car also has a newer Double Den JVC head unit, as you guys saw. And it does have the electronic touch and climate control. And I doubt you'll be able to see it on camera, but the indicator is working there on the dashboard. Brakes feel great. Pedals right at the top where it should be. We'll go ahead and pull in here and make a U-turn. Turning radius is good. But you guys can see the car drives, shifts great, no overheating. Show you guys that the radio works. The original radio is located in the trunk in a box, as well as the build sheet for the vehicle. But you guys can see this car is just floating right along. Alignment's great. No steering wheel shake like the tires are unbalanced or anything like that, or out of balance rather. But again, if you guys have any questions about the car or just general questions about shipping, financing, whatever the case may be, give us a phone call. Again, that's 614-276-7355. I'm gonna go ahead and end this video here. If you guys did enjoy it, be sure to give this video a big thumbs up. Press the subscribe button and turn on the bell to get notified every time we list a car for sale. I will see you guys in the next one. Take care.